inspiration a stress. I'm gonna draw something special. Oops. Better sharpen my pencil. Let's go for some green this time. I'll need to sharpen this pencil, too. This might be some of my best work. Hold on. Well, pencil, you had a good run. But it's time to join your friends. I thank you for your service. Your fellow pencils will be proud. But it was a sacrifice worth making. Pretty good, huh? Ooh. I am looking good. Ugh. Oh yeah, that's it. We're all done here. Right. Who's next? <laughs> that would be me. Let's get this over with. Whoa, I love your style. I can work with this. I love the monochrome look. How about a smile? How about no? Okay, you like the moody look. I get it. What is it? Is… is that a hand? It's with me. This is so weird! Ah! Get off me! Ah! My camera! <laughs> Oops. I can't use this. It's ruined. How am I supposed to take photos now? Hang on. Maybe I can use this. I think it might work. It's worth a shot. Just stay there. I'll just sketch out your face. Then I'll go over it with heavier lines. I'll take my time. I'll apply different amounts of pressure to the pencil. This'll give me shading and texture. It helps make the drawing look more realistic. Wow, those eyelashes look great! I wish I could do my mascara like this. Now for the other eye. I really want to capture your essence. The eyes tell a story. Smudging the drawing gives me shadowing. I can use this special tool for that. And it stops my hands getting dirty. Using a white pencil gives me contrast. It helps give the impression of light and darkness. This is going well! Now for a little shadowing around the eyes. This will accentuate the natural curves on your face. Those cheekbones are poppin'! Wow! Now I'll add a little more detail around the eyes. You can't rush perfection. It's really coming together. Next, I'll work on the lips. Mixing the light and dark pencils gives depth. It makes it stand out. And the drawing comes to life. Now it's time for the hair. Using light and heavy lines helps give the impression of hair. I'll leave a gap in the middle. This will be the light reflecting. Then I can work on the braids. I'll keep going over the braids. It'll make them fuller. Then I'll do the opposite side. It's just the same process. Building up the layers and the texture. I want to keep the light reflection in the same spot. Now I can start to work on the body. I'll go over it lightly and use the blending tool to create shading. I'm glad you're not wearing multicolored clothes. It makes my job so much easier. Once I've sketched it out, I'll go over it with black pencil. I'll apply more pressure. I think it's finished! It's better than any photograph I've taken. I've really nailed your creepy stare. Check it out! What do you think? I hope you like it. Is that me? <laughs> I look so pretty. You're so talented. I was getting worried for a moment. I thought you were gonna set the hand on me. Here you go! Phew. Now, uh, get out of here. Can I look now, mom? Happy birthday! Yay! Thanks, mom! I've got something for you. Really? For me? You deserve it, honey. Wow! I wonder what it is. Ooh, this is so exciting! I love surprises! Whoa! Is that an iPad? Wow! Thanks, mom! This is awesome! I'm so happy. I love you, honey. Hmm, I have an idea. I'm gonna draw something. Ooh, this is good. It's a beautiful butterfly. Wow, that was so easy. Wait, what's happening? Wow, look at that! It's so magical! What else should I draw? I have an idea. Should I? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. I'll draw a large pile of cash. And now, I wait. Something's happening. I think it's working. Whoa! Look at all this cash! Whoa! I'm rich! 
I've never seen so much money! And it's real! I'm going on a shopping spree later! But first, I've got something else to draw! Here goes! I've sketched out a faint outline, then I'll go over it. Now I'll draw the eyes. It's looking good already! And next, I'll do the nose and the smile. I like this! And now for the body. That's one cozy-looking jacket. I wouldn't mind one of them. That's the main parts done! I can start working on the finer details. I'll create the logo on the bandana. This can just be a spiral. It's time to add color. I'll use yellow for the hair. I think he suits being a blonde! I'll use blue for the bandana. I'll use different shades of blue. Then I'll add shadowing. I want to create contrast. I'll give a metallic look. It's so effective! I'll use a light pink for the skin. Then I'll add darker pink under the nose and on ears. Using the iPad makes it so much easier to give my drawings texture and realism. It's just finding the spots where the light falls. Then choosing different tones. I'll use a darker shade of pink on the neck. This would be in shadow. I'll add more details to the hair. It makes his hair look spiked. Now I'll zoom in on his eyes. He'll be a blue-eyed boy. Now I'll add some black lines on it. Now I'll select the cutting tool. I'll carefully go around the eyes and the eyelids. Then I'll remove the color. What's next? I know! The clothes! I love this color! It'll need some shadows. Once this is done, I can color the rest of the jacket. I'll use a denim blue for this. That was quick! I'll add some black to it. I need to select a thin line. I'll add whiskers because… why not? I'll color the background. I think it's ready! Wow! It's amazing! Come on! What's taking so long? Finally! Woohoo! Hey, what's going on? I drew you! Oh, that makes total sense! So this is my birthday party! The party was great. I never danced so much. Jake did what? No way! He's so funny! Good. I'm not late for class. These paint supplies are so awkward to carry. Oh, there's a seat next to Ashley! No! Uh, what was that? I tripped. Huh? You better fix this. Or else. Uh, I'm so sorry! It was an accident! I'm just kidding. I have another one, see? Sorry, the nerd fell over. So, does this mean you don't want this? You're just gonna throw it away? Looks like I've got a free laptop. Hang on, I have an idea. I need to personalize it. I'll start by pouring white paint over it. I don't need a lot. That should do it. I'll use this to spread out the paint. The roller will give a nice, even coat. I'll paint right up to the edge of the laptop. I don't want to miss any spots. Now I'll wait for it to dry. I've switched to a thinner brush. I'll paint this corner yellow. It's gonna be the sun. And I'll add sunbeams. This yellow is making me happy. It's so cheery. Next, I need pink paint. It might look random just now. But these will be love hearts. I'll leave some parts bare for now. I'll fill them in with a different color. They're gonna be musical notes. This one will be yellow. I don't want to paint over the pink. This section can be orange. It's gonna be so bright and colorful. I'll paint semicircles under the sun. I'll make them different colors. This laptop isn't gonna be boring. It'll definitely stand out. I'm not painting anything specific. I'm just letting the creativity flow. Ooh, I know what to do here. I want it to be like flames. I'll start with a red outline, just like this. Then I'll fill it in with yellow paint. I'll leave parts white. It just adds to the effect. Now I need to fill in the rest of the laptop. How about some purple? Yeah, that's nice. Next, I'll fill in the gaps between the sun. I'll use a vibrant orange. And then blue around the edges. I'll put some white clouds in here. I'll let all the paint dry. Then I'll grab a black pen. I'll draw around the individual parts. It'll add an outline. I'll separate the heart. 
and go around the musical notes. Next, I'll add some details. I'm done with the pen, but I need some more white paint. This'll give the impression of light reflecting. And then I'll add black paint for texture. Wow, look at it! It just needs some finishing touches. I know! I'll add some dark patches on the flames. There! I'm done! I impress myself sometimes. I love it! Wow! It beats having stickers on it. This is my lucky day! Maybe I should drop paint on more of Ashley's things. I need a new phone. This is spooky. Mindy? Hello? Mindy, are you in here? I hope he shows up. Huh? Ugh, my eyes! You made it! Of course I did. I've missed you. I hate it when we're apart. I can't believe we have to sneak around. I've been looking forward to this all day. Me too. Not so fast. No kissing in school! I'm standing right here, lady. What did you say? This megaphone is too loud! You know the rules. Romance is bad! I'm calling for backup! Take them away! You got it. I love my job. Uh -oh. There's only one thing for it. I hope this works. I need to be quick. I'm almost done. Here goes. Huh? What? Where are we? Look! It's time for an art challenge! Pretty cool, huh? Ugh, oh, really? Hey, you. You really suit that tiara. Do you think so? You're gonna make me blush. Ew, pass the sick bag. I have something for ya. Catch it. Love you. Ooh, got it! He's just so sweet. Can we just get on with it? Isn't he perfect? Wait, what's he doing? Sorry, I need to take this. Where are you going? Seriously, why are we here? I could be grating. I think you need this. Thanks. I thought we had something special. How could he do this? What the? We could have been so happy together. Ugh, boys are all the same. Yeah. So you used up all my toilet roll. I was keeping that for later. Hmm, I have an idea. I'll gently squeeze the tube and shape it into a love heart. Then I'll dip it into red paint. I want to coat the bottom of the tube. That looks about right. It's like a stamp. Now I can press it onto a blank sheet of paper. I just need to apply some pressure. And I'm left with a love heart. I'll do this over the paper. If I repeat it, I'm left with a thicker heart. What are you doing? I can't believe I did that. But if it stops her crying… Anyway, I'm done. Everything reminds me of true love. My heart's breaking. Can't I just be happy? Huh? What's happening? Let me see that. Ugh, you're ruining the paper. It's not my fault. I think I can use my pain to create art. I'll give it a go. I'll draw inside the water droplets. I'll sketch a cute love heart. I've added color to the droplets. It just makes them look better. I think I'm done. I'm pretty happy with that. What do you think? Wow. Amazing, darling. I love it. You win. Are you kidding me? I actually created something. She just cried. What? Do you want a round of applause? Bravo. Do you feel better now? Whatever. Ooh, I'm so tired. So what are we doing now? I really need a manicure. Hmm, I think it's time for a prank. I'm going to enjoy this. Go on, get the laser. Huh? What's going on? Gimme! I want it! Oh, so close! Stop it! No way! I'm having too much fun! That's it! I need to do something! I can use this flipbook. I'll start by drawing a figure at the side of the page. Then I'll add some color. I'll show you. But I'll need to finish it first. Hmm. I'll turn the page and draw the figure again. This time they're in a slightly different position. I can't forget to color them in. I'll do this on every page. And I'll make slight changes to the character each time. 
it should look like this. Hey, they're dancing! Wait! Something's happening! My arm! It's out of control! Make it stop! This is great! Hey, you got some nice moves! This isn't funny! I disagree! I can't take anymore! Stop! Fine. I think you've learned your lesson. Phew! Finally! Oh, I'm exhausted. Two can play that game. I know what to do. It's time for some payback. I'll start by drawing an R, and then I'll add a line at the bottom. Now I can fill it in with yellow ink. I just need to keep it neat. Okay, now for the next part. I'm going to draw Mindy. Then add arms and legs. I'll color the hair. I think that's pretty similar. How about some rosy cheeks? Perfect! I can't forget about the boots. Aw, it's looking cute. But there's one thing missing. A rainstorm! <laughs> there. It's done. What's done? Check it out. It's you! Huh? That didn't go to plan, did it? I bet you feel silly. Just you wait. It's showtime. Let's make it rain. I'm waiting. Wait, what the? Hey, hey! Quit it! Not so smart now, huh? That wasn't very nice. Why would you do that? You better not try that again. Just for that, Mindy wins. Woohoo! He's so dreamy, isn't he? Hey, cutie. Right back at ya. Rawr. Rawr. You're such a flirt. No, you are. I get a warm, fuzzy feeling when I'm around you. That might be the sweetest thing anyone's ever said to me. Get off the desk! Bad cat! Human! Whatever you are! What? What's happening? No! What have you done? <laughs> He's perfect! <laughs> I always wanted a cat, but I'd prefer a boyfriend. Do you smell that? It's so bad. He smells fine. Would you like some milk? Achoo! Oops. Excuse me. Achoo! I can't stop sneezing. I noticed. I don't feel so good. I think I'm allergic to cat hair. Look at me. Fine, I'll change him back. You, I'm me again. What is that smell? It's you! You need a shower! Ugh, I can still taste it! It's everywhere! Is that fur? This is why I hate pets! Yuck! I need to fix my makeup. Wait a second. These flowers are beautiful. But not as beautiful as you, Mindy. You seriously like this guy? Okay, I know what to do. Tell me more! Give me that hair! Ouch! I enjoyed that. I'll stretch out the hair, and I'll color it with my lipstick. It's such a lovely shade of red. Now I'll place it on this sheet of paper. I want to curl it around, just like this. That looks about right. Now I'll close the sketch pad over. I'll apply some pressure to it. Then I'll pull out the hair. This is fun! When I open the sketch pad, there's an image left behind. It's amazing! What do you think? I know. I'm super talented. Uh, can I borrow your makeup, please? Fine. Take it. Thanks. I need some powder. Hold on. I can use this. I'll put the makeup sponge right here. I need to wet it slightly. Then I'll color it with a pen. I'll start with purple. I only want to color a small section. Then I'll switch colors. I'll do this all the way around the sponge. I want to make the sponge multicolored. Just like this. That looks good. Now I need a blank piece of paper. I'll press the sponge onto it. I'll hold it there for a while. I want the colors to transfer. When I lift it, a colorful circle is left behind. Then I can write a personal message. This should let him know how I feel. I love calligraphy. It looks so elegant. That's it! I'm done! It's just what I wanted! Now I'll cut the paper! Uh, I made this. Oh. It's for you! Hopefully you feel the same way. Do you? Whoa! Mindy! Of course I do! With all my heart! What?! Look at this! It's a work of art! 
You are one angry lady. Fine. You win. Happy now? Now where were we? That's all I wanted. Nana! Huh. Is this the place? I think so. It looks creepy. I know. Should we go in? I'll get the door. Hmm. It's locked. That's annoying. What should we do? Now let me think. I know. Turn around. Um, okay. I need to draw around my hand. <laughs> that tickles. But that's a good idea. I'll do the same. Stop moving. I'm almost done. This is looking good. There, I'm finished. Uh, it's not my best work. It's not gonna be hanging in any galleries. Nah, this isn't gonna do. Here's my drawing. Oh, wow. oh, but remember, it was rushed. Oh, that's amazing. Are you seeing this? Where's it going? Hey, we need your help. We need to get inside. What are you waiting for? That's it. It's locked tight. Come on. It's working. The door's opening. Let's go. I wonder what's it like inside. We're about to find out. <laughs> oh, I'm so bored. Hmm, I know how to wake her up. How about a little karaoke? Huh? Oh no, anything but that. Sha la 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 la! Oh no, it's the banshees. Ashley, stop it! So bad! My ears are hurting! Uh, Ashley, I don't think this is good. I think you should put the microphone down. Oh, yeah! She's still asleep? Oh, mommy, I don't want to go to school. I guess she's not a fan. Ahem. Oh, wee! Oh, who told her she can sing? Still nothing? Oh, tough crowd. Hit it! Oh, la, la, la! Hey, sit down! I need to do something. I'll be right back. Still going. I can't believe it's come to this. Please make it stop. I can't take it anymore. She'd waken the dead. Let me know when it's over. Take it to the bridge. Shut up. Hey, knock it off. Wait a second. I have an idea. I'll try anything. I need this toilet roll. I'll cut the tube into two sections. I'll take one section. And I'll apply tape to the edge. I'll put it all the way around. That should do it. Now I'll make a small cuts in it. I'll keep them evenly spaced out. Just like this. Now I'll take my other hand. And I'll stick the tube to it. I'll need my concealer. I'll squirt it onto the tube. And I'll use a makeup brush to blend it. I want to cover the tape and the tube. I don't want any showing. Then I'll do the same with my hand and nails. Next, I'll need powder makeup. I just need a thin coating. I want to lighten the tone slightly. That looks good. Next, I need a pan. I'll draw thin lines across my hand. I want it to look like a scar. I'll add a little color to my nails. Then I'll add scars to my fingers. Wow, that looks good. And spooky. It's the thing of nightmares. Time to shut Ashley up. I think I'll turn up the lights. Huh? What happened? Mindy? Is that you? Who? Who is there? I don't like this. Stay back! I know karate! Where are you? Wait, what was that? Something's touching me. You're behind me, aren't you? Huh? Nothing's there. This is so weird. Maybe I'm imagining it. It was so freaky. The lights went out. And then something grabbed me. Yeah, it sounds really strange. Hold on. Is that better? Yeah, thanks, Mindy. What a relief. Oh, no. No, it can't be. It was real. Huh? It sure was. Ah! What? Huh? Relax, it's just my hand. 
See? There's nothing to worry about. What's going on? What the? It was you! Oh, hey! You're awake! What are you doing? It wasn't me. It was the hand. Uh, is this a good idea? Whoa! What is that thing? I got this new dress. It will look great on you. Here comes the teacher. Hi, class. Happy birthday to me. Oh, what is this? I can't wait to open it. Wait, it's her birthday? I don't have any gifts. So, who cares? I need to give her something. I know. I must have something in my bag. Hmm, I can't give her a rubber duck. Nope, none of this will do. I'm out of ideas. You're giving up that easily. Okay, let me have a look. Yeah, I have something we can give her. You carry around a trash bag? Ah, uh, okay, I get it. Do you think she'd like bugs? Uh, no. Ugh. Hmm, I can't let Ashley see this. Love you, Teddy. Now, where was I? Nope, I've got nothing. It's okay, I'll make a call. Hello? It's not a big deal. Thanks for your help. <laughs> Whoa, that was quick. Hmm, they smell amazing. Flowers? But they're beautiful. Go on, smell them. I hate flowers. I mean, uh, I'm allergic. Hmm, that gives me an idea. I'll paint on the palm of my hand. I want to create a flower. I'll draw the leaves and petals on my fingers. It's important I do this against a black background. It really helps create something special. Once that's done, I can start filling it in. I want to cover a lot of it with black paint. Then I can add color. I'll use silvery white for the petals. It just makes them stand out. Then I'll use a vibrant green for the leaves. I'll use a lighter shade to create contrast. Then it's a case of adding the finer aspect. I'll go around the petals, giving them details. And I'll add an outline. I think that should do it. I'm pretty happy with that. That's my kind of flower. Hey, Ashley, what do you think? You like flowers, right? Huh? Did you do that? Yeah, I thought it might come in handy. Get it? Let's give them to the teacher. Hey, teacher! Oh, uh, yes, what is it? I got something for you. Really? For me? That's too kind. I got you something, too. Wow, it's beautiful. I've never seen anything like mm -hmm. it. Hold on, I need to take a picture. I love it. Oh! I think she likes it. This is the best birthday ever. It's important to stay hydrated. I'm thinking of getting a new style. Any ideas? Why are you asking me? Just dye it black. Yeah, no, I was thinking you should go blonde. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Hey, can we have something to do? Huh? Oh, right. Let me think. Oh, I've got it. How about a little magic? Ladybugs are always cute. On you go. Wow, look at that. This is so cool. I feel like a cartoon princess. Whoa, thanks. Now, what about you, Mindy? Hmm, I've got just the thing. I think you're gonna like it. Wait, not so fast. Stay back. I mean it. Make yourself comfortable. What? What's happening? Okay, that's never happened before. Whoops. I'm colorful. No, I don't like that. Get away from me. Ooh, I love butterflies. They make me so happy. Phew, that was close. Hmm, I still don't have anything. Wait a second. Maybe I can use the ladybug. Don't be scared. You can go right there. That's it. Strike a pose. You've inspired me. I'll start by drawing a triangle. Then I'll add some lines. Now I'll draw a circle around it. Then the head and antennae. Every ladybug needs dots. I'll color the dots with black ink. That's perfect. Then it's time for some red. I'll just go around the dots. I don't want to ruin it now. This red is so bright. I'll color the inside yellow. And that's it. My own ladybug. It looks great. What do you think? I think I nailed it. Wow. Whoa. It's like looking in a mirror. You're so talented, Mindy. I'm impressed. I think we're going to be great friends. 
Uh, Ashley? Hey! Huh? What is it? Oh, uh, give me a minute. I'll draw a love heart. And then a line coming out of it. This is gonna be the wings. A splash of red, and it's done. There you go. It's pretty, isn't it? Oh, wow. Nice work, Ashley. I'm so lucky to have you both in my class. I love your ladybug. This is gonna be so hilarious. Like a whole lot of laughs hilarious. Yeah. Ah. Oh no, I'm gonna fall in. Oh, since when was that hole there? Gotcha. Relax, it's just spray paint. Whoa, Mindy. I can't let you go in there alone. Wow! Awesome! Oh, what is this place? And what are we wearing? Hey, look! Oh, you finally made it! Ready to start creating? Let's start with the human face. It's quite a complex subject matter. Well, what are you two waiting for? And like a zoo, you can draw too! Wow, are these for us? We get to draw our own faces! Wow, let's do it! Well, anyone want to go first? Yes, yes, me, me! You're always such a goody goody. Ugh, whatever. Um, what about you? Yes, I'm gonna nail this assignment! Now give me your best look, okay? Yeah, how's this? Anything good? Ew, stop! Stop! What? This is my real face. You don't recognize it? Hmm. Oh! Stay just like that! Okay, all finished! What do you think? Is this you or what? Um, it's interesting. I think you need some glasses, cause that looks nothing like me. What? But this is some of my best work! If you say so. Ah, look. I'm gonna show you a little drawing trick. While this may just look like a doodle, it's actually the base of a real drawing. Can you recognize anything yet? See how I never even lift up my pen? It's just one continuous line. Ta-da! Here it is. It's got some real style, huh? But it still looks like a face. Where did you learn how to do that? Wow, it really is something. Mindy, way to go! For our next lesson, we'll talk about symbolism. Recognize this masterpiece? It's your turn to replicate it. Now get started. Hmm, it's so nice out today. Oh, so dirty. Much better. Oh, that's my print! Hey, get back here! Okay, let's think here. I think I have the print on my phone. Yep, all hope is not lost. Catch! Got it, thanks! Hey, this is actually kinda cool. Hey, you might? Okay. Hey, wait, that's not fair at all! Give me that thing! Hey! Let's see. Whoops, forgot about the wet paint. Ugh, come out! The teacher's gonna be really mad. Phew, this thing ought to help. Scrub-a-dub-dub! Is anything coming off at all? Oh, Mindy. Ugh, this is useless! Unless… I can blame it on Ashley. Bingo! It's the true perfect crime. These colors are really coming together. What's that phone doing over here? Hmm, I don't know. Super weird. Oh yeah? Ugh, what am I gonna do about this? The case is totally ruined. I know. I'll just work with what I've got. Use this sponge stamp. First, I'll put black around here. And keep going until it's totally covered. This may take a little bit of patience. See? You're almost done now! Next comes color number two. Blue! Whoa, this looks pretty cool! Add in some pink for a sunset look. The key is quick, light stamping. Then go in with a green hue here. Yep, just at the bottom part. It's really coming together now. Use a circle shape as you stamp white here. That way you get the perfect circle. Then you can fine tune with these. Don't worry, it'll make sense soon. It's all in the details. You can even make little stars. Now it looks like they're twinkling! All you need is a couple of them. Then just a few sprinkles of white. Looks like a sky full of stars! And for the final last touch… A fun little monster guy! Just use a little blue for it. And make sure to put it over the entire stencil. Almost done! And voila! 
But don't forget about the hands and feet. Yellow was perfect for these. And just a little red for the mouth. Now it's almost complete. We just need a little bit of texture. Use black for this part. Don't worry, it'll be a subtle detail. Just look for yourself. Wow. Aw, now this is what I call an art piece. Check it out! Hmm, what's going on over there, girls? Huh? This better be related to art. Let me see. Ugh, I'm so busted. May as well just bite the bullet. Ooh, this is magnificent. Really? No, wait, I'm the one who did it. Well, it is what it is. Oh, this is so unfair. Wait, who can play this game? Look it! Oh, you sure did a great job. Ugh. Ugh, he's so dreamy. Oh, I'm really feeling this chapter. Ugh, what is she doing? Wait, is that a guy she likes? Where'd she even get his picture? Wow, he's cute. Love you, baby. Is that your boo? Wait, let me see it. Ugh, he's not my boyfriend, okay? Jeez. No. Come on, please. Uh, okay, so we met one day at lunch. Aw, so I, uh, I like your shirt. Excuse me! Okay, guys, I know exactly what to draw. Just wait, it's gonna be great. Just watch, this is gonna turn out great. Nothing like a little bit of love to inspire you. But this is only half the drawing. The other half is what'll make it special. Aw, see how she's holding hands with someone? The color really makes it come alive. What color should her outfit be? We'll get to that in just a minute. Brown hair looks good on this guy. And perhaps he should wear an orange shirt. And blue jeans ought to match nicely. And on to our girl. She looks oh so pretty in pink. We're pretty much done here. True love at its finest. And that deserves a great big heart. There's no better symbol for love, is there? Looks like we're all finished. Hey, look what I made. What? Not on my watch! Get back to work! <gasps> Sorry! Hey, take it. <laughs> now. As I was saying, hold your paintbrush like so. Okay, that was close. What's in this thing anyway? Aw, it's two people in love. This is seriously so cute. But there's a small detail that needs fixing. And it's my favorite color, too. Okay, almost there. And now this is way more me. Don't you think? Oh. Yeah, that makes way more sense. Go give it to him. I'll cover for you. <laughs> I have something for you. It's supposed to be me and you. It really looks like us, too. Yeah? When it comes to font, it's all about conveying emotion. See the swoop on this F here? Oh. Be right back, kids. Score! I can do whatever I want now. Ooh. Huh? What do you think you're doing? Living my best life, obviously. Ugh, whatever. Do you. <gasps> Look at this meme! Whoa, that's cool! I know, right? Here, take a sip. This is actually pretty fun! While you ladies laugh and snack, I'll be taking care of business over here. Phew, I'm so thirsty. Mmm, thanks for these. Hey, what's over there? They seem pretty distracted over there, which is good news for me. Uh, ugh. All for me. Um, where's all of our stuff? Now all I have is this flat pencil. Look at this. Hmm, I know exactly what to do. Cut out a little square. Now fold it in half and cut it in a curved pattern like this. Perfect. Now open it up, but not all the way. Then place it in the tip of the pencil. Then tape it here to keep it secure. There! All done! See? Hey, Ashley! Look what I made! Over here! See? What? Oh, you can use it on the paper, see? Once it has ink on it, it draws! It's a handmade calligraphy pen. Just takes a few careful strokes. I'm almost done! See how smoothly it writes? Ta-da! Done! Hey! I'm done too! 
See the little marks I made? Ciao! Hello? Oh, she's back! Oh, bravo! What beautiful lettering! Well done! Fabulous! Hmm, I feel like a makeover. Something a little different. Oh, that looks good. Wow, I want to try it! This is awesome, mom! I could do this all day! It's like a rainbow in my eyes! Okay. What's happening? Where… where are we? This is so cool! We should hang out more often! Ready to start? Oh, that's so romantic! Look at all these feathers! I love this! <laughs> Your first challenge! Draw this little guy! He's cute and cuddly, so do a good job! Go! Okay, let's do this. Uh, where do I start? I'm the artistic one in the family. Whoa! Paint! I've gotta have it! Mm -hmm. No way! Where did you get those? Mom's like an art supply store. Can't forget my water pot. Huh? Where did my paints go? Huh? Oh! I should've known! Chris, give me that! Careful, mom! You almost ruined my painting! Sorry, honey. Meh. Hang on. I have an idea! I'll press my hand onto the canvas. I want to make sure all the paint goes on. Now I can start to fill it in. And add a head. This is so much easier. And it's really calming. Now for the legs. And every flamingo needs water. It looks great! I'll highlight the beak with a black pen. It just adds some definition. Next, I'll draw the eye. I'll go around the legs with a pen. Finally, I'll add some little details. I think I'm finished! What do you think? Yeah, dad! Who won? This is so exciting! Good job, buddy. But mom wins this round. Yeah! I really thought I had it. Looks like our model needs to poop. Oh. Okay. Ew. <laughs> this is gross. Can we keep him, mom? Awesome! I promise to walk him every day. Or fly him. Do I remind you of anyone? Huh? Whoa! <laughs> it's… it's… a minion! Look, mom! I can't take my eyes off of it, honey. Banana! Uh, Chris? I'm a minion, too! <laughs> we need that toilet paper, sweetie. And where did you find that hoodie? I want you to draw a minion! Uh -huh. I'm so nervous! I hope I do you justice! Hmm, what medium should I use? Uh, Chris? Can't talk! Drawing a minion! Oh. Okay. I suppose I better get started. Yellow will be a good start. Hmm, this is trickier than I thought. Mmm, I love bananas. Hey! Careful! What's the big idea? Hmm. Wait a minute. I know what to do! But I need another banana. Hey! This is more important. I'll start by drawing a circle on the banana. This will be the minion's eye. Then I'll add his glasses. That looks good. Now for his mouth and his clothes. I can start to paint him now. I just need to make sure I stay in the lines. What sparkling white teeth you have! This blue paint is perfect for his dungarees! Now I need to wait for the paint to dry. I can use this pen to create an outline. He's almost finished! There! He looks good! And I made him some friends! A cute bunch of minions! What do you think? Mm -hmm. This is great! My masterpiece is complete! Uh… Where are you going? I miss him so much! Don't cry, honey! It's a cruel, cruel world! I know what'll cheer you up. Have a banana! I don't wanna… Whoa! It looks like a minion! This is awesome, mom! Thanks! I'm glad you like it. Aw, I'm all out of bananas. You can have one of mine. For real? Wow! This is the best-looking banana I've ever seen! Are you okay, Chris? 
Sure am, Mom! Let's play! Banana! Bottom! Let's get back to nature. These fern leaves are your next challenge. Whoa! How did you do that? These are so pretty. I'm gonna have a closer look. Hmm. Interesting. It's definitely a leaf. Time to start drawing! I can feel my creativity flowing. This is gonna look great. That's nice, dear. Ugh! It all went wrong! I can't do it! You can do anything. It's the stupid leaf! It's too hard! Let me help you. Watch this. Place a piece of paper over the leaf. Then take a crayon. Rub the crayon gently over the paper. It'll create an impression of the leaf. You can even use different colors. Just like this. Now I'll take a pen and draw the outline of the leaf. It's actually very easy. Just follow the crayon. It makes the colors really stand out. I'm almost finished. There! What do you think? Wow! That was so clever! Thank you, honey. You give it a try. Here goes! Time is up. But… but… this is a disaster! Hmm. They're both really good. But mom wins! Oh, goody! Watch this. This deserves to be hung on a wall. Great job, honey! You're too kind! Oh, I know! I'm gonna draw Huggy Wuggy! I'll use the crayon trick! Uh, good luck with that. Put your hands like this! And then you do this! Uh… Okay, you two. Let's watch some TV. Aw, would you look at that! No! No! Stay back! Hmm. What are you doing? Oops. Sorry. How's this? Chris, honey. It's okay, look. There's a cute teddy bear. Whoa! It's so fluffy! I prefer that type of bear. I can draw that. Good boy. Mm, this won't do. I better start again. Hmm. I'll start with the face. This is harder than I thought. It's so frustrating. Mom! Be careful! I just can't get it right. Don't give up, mom. Oh! I have an idea! I'll start by drawing a figure eight. Now I'll draw a circle around the top, then add ears and eyes. Next I'll draw the body. I'll do a little baby bear, too. This is such a quick and easy way to draw. And they look awesome. It's a mommy bear and a baby bear. Look, mom. I did it! You're so talented, sweetie! We can share it. This game is great! Pew pew! I'm the best! That's nice, sweetie. Hey! This isn't over! Yoo-hoo! Oh. This is serious business! Here's your next challenge. Ugh. It's pretty impressive, huh? Wow! I want it! The scale might be tricky. Look at it. It's glorious! I'm in love! You're my best friend! Ooh, so that's the answer? I'm gonna enjoy this. Mmm. Wow. That life would be perfect. Huh? Mom started already? Let me see that. You're in the way, honey. I need to hurry up. But I'm not good under pressure. Okay, focus. I'll start with a circle. I'm happy with that. Uh-oh. Mom's drawing is pretty good. It's a lot better than mine. Ugh! I need to fix this! Ha! I have a plan! But I need to be sneaky. I'll take a photo of the gum. Got it! Then I can print it. Whoa! It worked! And no one will ever know. Look, mom. How does it look? What? That's so good! I'm actually embarrassed about my drawing. But I did my best. Ahem. Huh? Uh, I, I was just resting my eyelids. Let me have a look at your drawings. <laughs> Please pick me! Chris has this one! You win the gum! 
Wow, what a day! I'll love you forever. Or until I eat you. Well done. It was a great drawing. Wait a minute. Did you? You cheated! You saw nothing! Huh? I'm disappointed <laughs> in you, Chris. I heard there's a special place where all magical beings roam free. Can you believe it? One moment. Let me just grab my book here. Wouldn't you die to meet a real-life unicorn? Is the sky blue? Shall we? We can read the book together. Look at all the colors. And that magical horn. What's going on? I don't know. Something's happening with the book. Whoa! Where are we? And look at these outfits! <laughs> Pretty and pink for sure! Blue raspberry is my jam! <gasps> Ashley! Look! There's something up there! You looking at me, girl? Perhaps you're staring at my gorgeous unicorn horn! Don't you love my sparkles? You'll love this challenge even more! Watch the wheel spin! Ready to draw? Actually, it's a drawing challenge! We were born ready! First up in our drawing challenge… Let's spin the wheel and find out! So exciting! Looks like the wheel has finally chosen a topic! Wow! Meow! <laughs> wow. We love cats! They're simply the cutest! <laughs> so cute and fuzzy! Girls, we're drawing, remember? Oh, okay. Hmm. Should I make mine a tabby? Uh, I think I will. Yeah. Sit still, okay, little guy? Hmm. Huh. Is this even accurate? No, I don't think so. Now we're talking. Better check the head and the whole body. Hmm, I want my proportions to be right. Hmm, it's still not right. These can work. Just need a pinch of fur. That's enough! <gasps> Good thing I'm wearing goggles! <sighs> Let me look at my calculations. Yep, just as I thought. Huh? What's Luna doing over there? The results are in! It's what I suspected all along. It's time to get artsy in here! So long, science clothes! And let's go! I'll draw the best cat for sure! <laughs> Show us what you got, girls! Time's up already? Here's the tabby cat I drew! At least it's something. Don't be shy. Isn't it cute? Very nice, Ashley. <laughs> wow, that is really good. Look! I'll show you how to do it. Start with the word cat. Then build off the letters. A circle for his head, little ears, and of course whiskers. Then his tail, tummy, and little feet. You can add colorful details too. Like this orange for his ears and cheeks. Don't forget his little face! Of course! I'm making him a gray kitty. I'll have to color in his entire body. All the way to his tippy toes. And some stripes look good too. I'll use a darker gray for those. And I think he's done! Cool, huh? They kind of look alike, don't they? They do! <laughs> oh, such good girls. Okay, time for another spin. <laughs> what do you think it'll land on? <gasps> Hearts are our favorite! 
And we have the perfect models! Are you ready? One… Two… Three… Go! So handsome! He has my heart all right. And he is so cute! <gasps> That's my Chris! Your Chris? He's mine! No, he's mine! Ooh, looks like they're fighting. Well, this is awkward. He's mine! I saw him first! Hey, don't fight, girls! Keep away from my Chris! No, you keep away! Hey, you give me no other choice. And poof! Unicorn magic will deal with this problem because it can pretty much do anything. <laughs> Not so handsome anymore. Sorry, girls. He's mine! Huh? Has he always looked like this? Ugh! What was I thinking? Huh? <gasps> His smile looks different. I hate to judge. <clears throat> we still have a wheel to spin. Oh, right! Hey, Luna! Is that Chris? Where? There's nothing over there but empty space. <laughs> Sucker! I'll just be taking these. Don't see him. Where? <gasps> My markers are all gone! Oh no! Ashley! Did you take them? No, I have no idea. Does she suspect me? Well, that wasn't very nice. Time for some more unicorn magic. <gasps> Try to steal her stuff now. Help! Is Ashley frozen? Oh, these are mine. Thank you very much. Work time! We're drawing hearts, right? To make a perfect heart, enclose it in a rectangle. Just like this. And add stripes with a ruler. All the way from the top to the bottom. Then curved lines in the heart. You don't need a ruler for this part. You can use different colors. I'll fill in this stripe with the orange. And then green and red too. Outline the heart and make it nice and dark. I'll just use a pencil. That should work okay. Now make both sides match. Just a touch of shading. Use white to make a sheen effect. And add a frame. There! I think that's great! My heart's finished and it's 3D! Okay. And unfreeze. Lesson learned, I guess. Look at my drawing. Do you like it? Oh, it sure is incredible, Luna. <laughs> so cool! Uh -huh. Sorry about the theft. It's okay. Forget about it. <laughs> For me? Thank you! Aw, that's better. As long as I have Chris. <laughs> What's next? Okay, girls. Here we go. Where will it land this time? Hands! Now it's your turn. We're drawing hands, huh? Interesting. Hmm. I have an idea. <gasps> Check that out! <laughs> what happened? Luna, where are you? Are you okay? Uh, just a little electric surge. Is that shadow my hand? <gasps> I just had the best idea ever! Power's back on! 
And we have light, ladies and gents. Woohoo! Woo Guess we don't need this flashlight anymore. Let's do it. First, trace your hand. It shouldn't be that hard. Then turn your hand into an adorable little bird. I'll add an eye on my thumb, and then a beak. Next up, he needs a wing and some feet. Now I'll add a little color. I think orange for his beak is good. Don't forget about those little feet. And color a bird in with white chalk pen. This is the easiest part for sure. Just gotta make sure he's fully colored. Hmm. I don't know how to draw this thing. Maybe my hand like this? Huh? That looks stupid. Anything? Or how about this? Uh, I just don't see it. Ha! That's the one! Oh, what the heck? Spider webs? Oh, my aim was a little off. Guess I need something else. Let's try this one. Trace your hand like this. All the way around, but stop at your wrist. Then, turn it into a cute little doggy. He needs an eye, of course. Doesn't look like a hand anymore, right? Let's add a collar and color it. I think he'll look nice in orange. Check out that giant tongue! And that needs some color, too! Then give him brown fur! Just fill him in with all the brown color. We don't want him to be missing any fur. Maybe some lighter color here. He's looking so good! Girls, time's up! Let's see what you drew! Check these masterpieces out! I love dogs! Oh! Those were your hands? Wow! Incredible! Just take a look at my bird! Isn't he cute? Wow! And your duck is just fantastic! Truly remarkable! Perfect! Oh, how do I choose a winner? Duck or dog? Which one? They're both so wonderful. Hmm. Oh, two judges for two deserving winners. Unicorn magic split me in two. There we go. That's just what I need. Hi. Wow! What is it? Magic? Wow. You both did so well. So we both won this round? Yes! 